For me personally, it's been incredibly um, exciting, you know, to see the history of the school. I'm in my second year here as the principal at St. Patrick, and so to find a bell with that much history um, is, is wonderful. It's a great connection with the past. Thirteen years ago when I started working here, my brother Brian, who worked here for 25 years, showed it to me. and. Uh, we uncovered it every once in a while for somebody and they'd get excited and then it would just get covered up again forgotten. This is the first time where there's actually actions being taken to do something about it. My husband went all his life to school here. He it will be 80 years old next summer. And he and eight of or seven of his brothers and sisters went here to school as well as three, three generations. Was that he remembers ringing it himself as a child. Um, he doesn't remember much past. That's a little hard for him to remember just where it was. He thinks it was near the center of the school. Uh, he says mostly recess. <laughs> um, at that time, there was at least an hour for lunch, and he lived about uh, seven blocks from here, and he walked home to school at lunchtime and back. So that bell was one of the things that was rang to dismiss for lunch or recess or what have you. Well, another employee, uh, Howard, who came in about the same time sister did, was down there uh, redoing the one wall. And uh, when he stumbled on, of course, he was very excited. And then he went and ran to sister, and she got excited. <laughs> and I just kind of looked and said, yeah, it's the bell. Uh, the future plans for the bell are that we would have it um, refurbished and we're looking at putting it on a mobile stand so that it can be moved. Um, and we were originally looking at an outdoor place for it, uh, but because it would tarnish again, uh, we're looking for an indoor place. Possibly the prayer garden if we can enclose it. Um, if not, we will look for a central place maybe in the front hallway of the school building. So it's very prominent.